Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, or of course, welcome if you are new. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays, first and foremost. I hope you are all having a wonderful holiday season and staying healthy. I am so stoked about today's video. I'm going to be showing you what I got for Christmas this year, and I'm going to throw out the disclaimer that literally everyone on YouTube says, but I am not filming this video to brag about what I got. I am literally just filming this for the sole purpose to entertain you guys. You guys seem to really love when I post haul videos and I personally really enjoy watching these videos. Like I've already watched six of these this morning just when I was getting ready. So I wanted to film my own and share some of the things I got. But of course Christmas is not about the materialistic things. It's about the people you share it with and the memories you make. And I'm so blessed to be home for Christmas this year and actually get to spend Christmas with my family. Obviously this year Year is a lot different than every other year but last year I was away on my job on the ship which again was amazing but it is really special to be home with your family for Christmas so very very grateful for that and before we hop into it make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're not already go ahead and follow me on my socials if you feel like it I post very frequently on my Instagram and without further ado let's hop into this video alrighty so I'm going to start off with my biggest gift if you will I cannot believe that I received this from my parents they are way too much. They did not have to get me this, but it is something that I have been wanting for a really long time I just like haven't gotten myself to buy it I've wanted this for almost a year now like since I was on my last contract on the ship So my parents just gifted me the GoPro Hero 9. I am so stoked about this. This thing is absolutely insane It takes amazing videos and pictures. It's 5k I think yeah, it's literally 5k. It's going to take some amazing skating pictures and videos as well as just amp up the quality overall of my videos. So I am very, very excited about this. I think I'm also going to film an unboxing video of this, so stay tuned for that. It did also come with a little memory card I just taped it to the back, and then it also came with a separate rechargeable battery. This is insane. I'm so, so excited, and I think I have the GoPro 2 or 3, so um, definitely bringing it up a notch. Aside from the GoPro, I'm also probably most excited about these. My parents also got me a pair of Doc Martens, the exact ones I wanted. So they just got me the traditional patent leather Doc Martens, and oh, Oh my god, these are so cute. They're so much cuter in person too. Let me just open the box. So here they are. They are absolutely stunning. I feel like I'm very, very late to this trend. I did not like Doc Martens a couple years ago, but I'm obsessed with these and I think they're so edgy and so cool and they will definitely bring my fashion game to a whole nother level. So I'm so, so, so excited to style these and they're just like they're so sick. Next thing I have to share is a purse. I freaked out a little when I got this, but my parents got me this absolutely stunning Kate Spade purse. It is like a three-tone bag, so it has the nude on the front. There is a little bit of white here, and then on the sides it is black. So it is just so unique, so stunning, and just so chic. And I do really love that it has two different straps. So it does have a long black crossbody strap, but you can also remove that and just use this gold chain. This is just like so cute, especially because shoulder bags are super in right now. So this is such a classic bag. It will never go out of style and it's so chic, so we'll go with literally any outfit during any season. But wait, there's more. They also got me this matching card holder, so it matches the bag perfectly. I would say my life is pretty put together, but never to the level that my wallet and my purse matches. You know what I mean? Like, you know those type of people? I'm not one of them, but now I guess I am. So these are just perfect together. I'm so excited. I'm definitely gonna change my bag today into this one. And this is nice and small, so you can just throw it into even like a little wristlet if you want. I did actually get another bag. This one is not Kate Spade, but it is very cute as well. So it is just like another little nude purse. This one is from TJ Maxx, I wanna say. I think this is a really cute little bag as well. And I do especially love this because it has this like rose gold chain and you can wear this bag either as a little shoulder bag or you can also wear it as a crossbody. So of course you can go like this or you can just pull to one side and use it as a longer strap. I'm gonna just be looking very put together with these bags, let me just tell you. My brother got me a milk frother. I'm so freaking excited about this. He actually brought it over like a few days ago, so I have been using it and it's worked amazing. The power is so strong. It's just the brand Zule Kitchen. It comes with a little stand so you can just set this up on the counter. You just have to throw two AA batteries in it, but like, do you hear that? It's crazy fast. 
It's very, very powerful. This is a game changer, so if you don't already have one of these, go get yourself one. Treat yourself. We're gonna move on to a few fashion items. So the first thing I have to share is this absolutely stunning herringbone coat. It is kind of like a pea coat, but it is like a suede material, so it's very, very soft. I'm going to look like the baddest bitch in this coat. Am I running errands? Am I going to a business meeting? Am I going out for a date? Who knows? But you could literally wear this coat anywhere, and it does also have like an extra strap so you can tie it tighter at the waist. It is a double breasted coat so there is buttons on both sides and I am just so excited about this. This is just such a great piece to have in my closet. My mom did very well with picking this out. I also got this black puffer vest. I love vests. I think they're so great for the winter and they're very great for layering as well. I love wearing vests to the rink because it's very easy to throw on and off and like I usually wear like four layers so I'll wear like a sports bra, a tank top, a long sleeve, a thinner jacket and then I can put this vest over top so I can just take it off easily when I get warmer but this is super cute and very functional as well and puffer outerwear in general is just very in right now so... Next is just a plain black champion long sleeve, or it is more of like a three quarter length shirt, I guess. This is such a staple. I wear black 80% of the time. I have so much black in my closet, but you can never go wrong. And this again is going to be amazing for the rink or for just lounging around. Like you can just never go wrong. And it is really, really soft as well. It's very good quality. So definitely excited about this. I've mentioned it in previous videos, but if you have missed it, I actually do have to wear smart casual on the ship when I'm in guest areas. Obviously, I'm not on the ship right now, but when I return, I will have to be prepared with my closet, of course, I have to be looking my best. It's just, I don't make the rules. My mom picked up these like really nice gray dress pants. They look a little bit cropped, which might work in my benefit. I don't know if they'll be full length on me or if they will be a little bit cropped, but they are really, really nice and they do have like an elastic waistband, so they are stretchy and I'm really hoping these fit me. They look very professional, but you can definitely like dress it up and style it really cool. Yeah, it says they're a capri, but you know, you really never know because I'm 5'1 and cropped pants are usually full length on me, so. I do have one piece of jewelry I want to share with you guys. My grandma got me this really beautiful star necklace. It's very, very dainty, but I love delicate jewelry, so this matches my vibe 100%. It is gold, and it just has these tiny little stars throughout the chain. This is a beautiful stacking necklace, but you can also just wear it on its own. The reason this is so special to me, too, is because my grandma said she bought it for me because I'm a star. Like, if your grandma doesn't hype you up like that, no one will. To go along with that necklace, she did also get me this little jewelry case. It is so cute. It has little peaches on it, and it's a really nice size as well, so it'll be perfect for traveling. I was just saying this, that I need one of these because I don't have one, and every time I travel with jewelry, my jewelry gets tangled. So this is just like the perfect size. There's a slot for your rings, bracelets or whatever, and a little pocket for necklaces. So I definitely will be getting a lot of use out of this. Next is really random, but there is, I promise, a backstory to it. So my parents got me a can opener. I can open cans with a can opener, but I am left-handed, so it is a lot harder because Almost all utensils and tools are made for righties. So as a fellow lefty, I'm struggling quite a bit in the kitchen. So this is just gonna be a game changer for me. It's gonna be a lot easier to open my cans without having to worry about it or having any issues. So is it a necessary gift? No, but it is going to be very, very useful and make my life significantly easier. My coaches from the rink actually got me a little gift which was so unnecessary but very very sweet of them. So they just got me a little Macy's gift card so very excited to use this up. I love shopping so I could never say no to money or a gift card you know you can't go wrong. I also got this little coral shaker bottle so a little backstory to this. I don't currently have a shaker bottle so anytime I make my protein shakes I have to use the cocktail mixer which is fine you know it does the job but this is just gonna be a lot more useful we've also got a little mug you know I could never have too many mugs I collect mugs I love mugs so this one is just a little black one it says sweater weather and has some plaid on the bottom perfect for all my little beverages this winter season and always happy to add a new mug to the collection so you know so cute. 
something I buy every single year before the new year begins is a planner because my old one expires but this year I don't have to because my parents got me this baby blue 2021 planner and this is the brand Ecolo I think I've had this brand of planner before it's so nice it has stickers inside it has a new quote for every single month and then it does also have this first page which is really nice because it has goals to do's just the calendar overall birthdays other important dates and reminders the next page is a full calendar and then after that it breaks it down day by day so it is going to be incredible for this 2021 because as you may or may not know I plan literally my entire life I love to write everything down I am such a planner and I make to-do lists so so this is very much needed and definitely going to get a lot of use out of this my grandma got me this little book it says the story of my life and the first thing I initially thought of was One Direction so that's when you know you have an obsession but it is really cute it's my favorite color and she did write a very special note to me at the front of the book so she basically instructed me to write all of my life stories in here anything worth writing down and keeping the memories to just throw them in this book and keep it until I get older I also got a pair of Flip flops, these are the brand Havanese, Havanas, Havanas? I don't, I don't know how you pronounce it, I'm very sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong, but they're cute, they're like a pink cheetah print. I also got some no-show socks, I can never have too many of these because I always seem to lose these socks, so now I have a few more pairs. This is a little random, but I got a little mini umbrella for my car. And lastly, I just want to go through my stocking really quickly. So first thing in my stocking was just a pair of false eyelashes. As a showgirl, I was very excited about these. I love fake lashes. I know I'm not wearing them right now, but like, these are really, really pretty. These are the brand Ilore, and it's the vlogger series. Also in my stocking was this pair of fuzzy socks. They're like a mint green color, really, really pretty color, and will keep my feet nice and warm. I think Santa went for like a self-care kind of theme for my stocking, so I also got this little headband for when I'm applying makeup or washing my face. It is fuzzy and it has a little bow on the front. Super cute and I feel like everyone has these except for me. I was kind of left out, so now I got one. I also got this little trio of Stila lipsticks, so they are the colors Vino, Patina, and Fiery. These are definitely colors I will use regularly and I love lipstick and makeup, so these are perfect for on the go because they're nice and small. There's also two different types of face masks in my stocking. So the first is a collagen face mask. I think it comes with five sheet masks and collagen is amazing for your skin. So this will be wonderful. And then I also have this little eye mask. This you can heat up or cool it in the freezer and it's supposed to be very, very soothing. And the final thing in my stocking was just this set of three little hair ties. So they are like a scrunchie and then they have some fabric hanging down at the end. These would be cute for like some half up, half down do's or some kind of braided hairstyle. But yeah, that is everything for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I got for Christmas this year. Again, I am so, so thankful and I'm very appreciative for everything I got and just Honestly, to me, it was more special to be home and getting to spend this quality time with my family more than anything. So I am just super grateful for that. And I hope you are all having a wonderful Christmas as well if you do celebrate. I cannot believe that Vlogmas has come to a close, but I really hope you guys enjoyed watching my daily uploads. And don't worry, I will have a lot of fun content coming for 2021. My upload schedule is every Monday and Friday at 11 a.m. Eastern time. So make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're not already and I think that's all I have to say I love you guys to the moon and back thank you again for watching and have a wonderful day bye guys